Look at these combustible elements. Triple threat action is up next. It's going to explode. We have Neville in a match against two of WWE's finest. Man, I'm getting goosebumps already. making his way to the ring. Big match for him here tonight. Sheep of the Wyatt family makes his way to the ring. Only in WWE are you going to get action like we're about to see in this one. And representing the Lucha Dragons from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 205. Lamast marvels on his way to the ring and looking to fly. Look at Sin Cara's feet. They barely touched the ground when he walked, Cole. He's a freak of nature. Here we go, guys. <laughs> this is going to be great. These three superstars are vying for the top spot here in WWE. This match will determine who is truly the best of the best. Don't be surprised at all if these guys attempt to one-up each other in this one. A triple threat match dictates all sorts of new strategy. Not only are you looking to get a pinfall, you got to have eyes in the back of your head for an attack from superstar number three. Regardless, we and the rest of the WWE world are in for a night to remember. As the action continues, let's discuss Neville briefly. He's got his hands full in this triple threat match. How does he climb that mountain? This is a great opportunity to make a statement. Coming out on top of these two will do wonders for a career. Only one of these three can win this triple threat match, and that means there are going to be two really, really angry competitors here real soon. Let me remind everybody, there are no countouts. These competitors can stay out here as long as they like. Hurricane Rana and Sin Cara is rolling. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. Oh, at this point, Cole, it's got to be getting hard to breathe. That chest is taking quite a beating. They're gasping for air. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match just as much as he does. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Oh, man, but this guy has spent a lot of time outside the ring. If I were him, I'd just keep this one inside the ropes and finish this thing. We've seen plenty of high flyers over the years, Cole. And after watching some Carter for a few years now, I'd have to say that he belongs among the elite class of WWE high flyers. I mean, he's just so amazing to watch. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. And I think it's on 
obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win here tonight. Oh, look at this. When you go at an opponent like this, it means you're out for blood. The WWE World Book goes right out the window. Trust me, it's going to get ugly. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Thinking about it now, I'd have to agree with you, King. See, Carr's awe-inspiring aerial assault certainly rivals that of Jimmy Snuka, Rob Van Dam, Rey Mysterio, and the other greats that have taken to the sky here in WWE. You know, it's almost as if the man can literally defy gravity. I know it sounds funny, but it's not all that far off. He's in full-on attack mode now. Takes to the air. Wow. That move did it. Now, this has gone way past the point of insults and gone right to humiliation. That's right. That was humiliating. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Oh, Neville may have it. Incredible move by Neville. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. I can't believe he can still go like that. Well, we need to acknowledge the scenario here. Squaring up against two opponents is never a good thing for your career. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Causing even more harm to the neck now. Yeah, and your neck is very fragile. That's got to be hurting. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. It's been a while. Look out! He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, this is brutal. That sledgehammer is a deadly weapon. Neville not in a good spot here. But things can change in an instant in a triple threat match. The truth is, though, he's still very much in control of this matchup. Come on. How many times is this guy going to use his finisher? It might be time to audible that game plan a bit. Oh, my gosh. slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. From the top! For the pin and the win! Now that is just dangerous. No kidding. Two, three. There's the pinfall and the victory. Here's your winner, Neville! There's no doubt about it. That's a big pinfall win right there. Three competitors walked in with legitimate chances of winning. But in the end, only one showed the resolve and the willingness to do anything necessary to pick up the win. And folks, I am happy to report that this triple threat match we just saw is now trending worldwide.